Hey, this is Mikey with a quick video, not a tutorial, but I want to talk about some things that I'm working on. So first off, if you haven't done so, go check out Cinema Spies. This is my website. This is my storefront to my tutorial channel. So I've got some presets. I've got lots of free things here. You can see free products, um, sound effects, different stuff, all available here at cinemaspice.net. So go check that out. First thing I want to talk about, though, is something called FameBit. And if you are a YouTuber, you need to check out FameBit. What FameBit is, is everyone's talking about uh, MCNs, multi-channel networks. And you join an MCM, and then they take part of your money. And they say that they're going to give you all these brand deals and increase your revenue and stuff like that. But it usually doesn't happen. And what FameBit is, is it's brand deals for people who and you don't need to be a part of any MCN. You don't need to sign any contracts. And so you sign up for this site, and you can find brand deals for your YouTube channel. And so I've done this a couple of times. Um, every once in a while, you'll see that I, I feature some products and things like that in my videos. And I find them. This is one way I can find these products. So it's really simple. Like right here, this thing, um, that's not something I would... Uh, feature okay right here so some headphones say I wanted to talk about some headphones I use headphones um, and so I could do a review on these headphones and then I can earn some money so really kind of a cool thing um, go check it out uh, it's you do need 1,000 subscribers so if you have a thousand or more subscribers you can sign up for this and there's no contract no really anything check it out sign up and see if there's any sort of uh, brand deals you could find for your YouTube channel and then I've got three other um, plugins and software that I'm, I'm in the middle of reviewing right now. And I want to just give you a heads up, and you can go check them out. And I want to know what you want to hear about first. So the first thing is Zach's Works uh, 3D Invigorator Pro version 8. Um, I've got a copy of this that I'm for review. I'm going through it right now and learning it. This is, um, this is the original 3D program that was used to bring 3D into After Effects before Element 3D was around and has lots of cool features. So I'm kind of going through it. It's There's a lot more you can do with it than you can with Element 3D. Um, it's different. There's some things that are the same. There's some things that are different. So that's one thing I'm working on doing a review of. The next one is GenArt's Sapphire. I've got the new version 8 that I'm doing a pre-release version um, uh, test of. So this has some new cool things where you can create pretty much your own effects. They've got kind of an effects builder built into it. Um, that's kind of fun, and so I'm looking through that right now. And then the third thing is FX Factory. Now, this is a Mac-only plugin, um, but what's cool about this is it's kind of like an app store for filters and effects and plugins, and it works with Final Cut, Motion, Premiere, and After Effects. So that's really kind of cool, and there's all sorts of different... Um, plugins you can buy different prices there's lots of free ones as well and this one like sapphire as well you can create plugins with it which is fun um, but unlike sapphire you can sell these plugins and you can have them distributed through their app store and things like that so those are the three uh, bits of software that i'm currently reviewing so which one would you like to see first is it zach's zach's works Pro Invigorator, 3D Invigorator Pro? Is it Sapphire 8 from Gen Arts? Or is it FX Factory? And with FX Factory, I'm going to also talk a little bit about creating uh, plugins with this. So those are the three that I'm reviewing. I want to know your opinion. What is most intriguing to you guys? What would you like to see first? And again, also check out FameBit, go sign up and see if you can get some brand deals for your YouTube channel. I know a lot of the viewers of this channel have their own channels, and so this might be something you're interested in. So thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.